the product of two consecutive page numbers is 342. Find the page numbers. So we're looking at consecutive page numbers, and we let the first page number be x. The next page number would have to be x plus one. And we know the product of these consecutive page numbers is 342, and therefore x times the quantity x plus one must equal 342. So if we solve this equation for x, we can determine the consecutive page numbers. So let's first clear the parentheses by distributing. X times x equals x squared, so we have x squared plus x times one is x equals 342. Notice how we have a quadratic equation. So let's see if we can solve the equation by factoring. So let's set the right side equal to zero by subtracting 342 on both sides which will give us x squared plus x minus 342 equals zero. And now let's see if we can factor the trinomial on the left side into two binomial factors. So because the first term is x squared, we know the first terms in the binomial factors would have to be x and x. And now if it does factor, we need to find the factors of negative 342 that add to positive one. And that's not easy to do. To help us do this, Let's find the prime factorization of positive 342. Well, 342 is even, and therefore we know it's divisible by two. 342 is equal to two times 171, and two is prime. Next, to help us break down 171, we'll use a divisibility rule of three, because one plus seven plus one is equal to nine, or the sum of the digits is equal to nine, and nine is divisible by three, so is 171. 171 is equal to three times 57. If we needed to, of course, we could take 171 and divide by three. There are five threes in 17. Five times three is 15. Subtract, bring down the one, and there are seven threes in 21. Seven times three is 21. And notice that five plus seven equals 12, which is divisible by three, and therefore so is 57. 57 is equal to three times 19. So now we have the prime factorization of 342. 342 is equal to two times three times three times 19. And notice that two times three times three is equal to 18. And therefore we know that 342 is equal to 18 times 19, which will help us determine the factors of negative 342 that add to positive one. If we use the positive factor of 19 and a negative factor of 18, we would get negative 342 and negative 18 plus 19 is positive one. And therefore one binomial factor is x plus 19. The other binomial factor is x minus 18. And this product is equal to zero when x plus 19 equals zero or when x minus 18 equals zero. So the solutions to the equation are x equals negative 19 or x equals positive 18. But we know a page number can't be negative, and therefore we can eliminate x equals negative 19. So the first page number is x, so we have x equals 18. The second page number is x plus one, which is equal to 18 plus one, which equals 19. So the two consecutive page numbers that have a product of 342 are 18 and 19. I hope you found this helpful.